Now we go to the third part, and this is also not so long. We talk about growth of cyclotrops. Cyclotrops are microorganism which love to live or grow optimally at average temperature, but they can still grow quite fast in a fridge in chilling condition like in seven to seven five to seven degrees c they can still grow quite okay and then they call issue of products which we store in chilling condition in vietnamese this group means chiu lan this is not the same with psychrophilic. Psychrophilic then grow optimally at low temperature. This one grow optimally at average temperature but can still grow at chewed condition. Okay, you remember. In previous part we already talk up we already classify already. Okay, again this is just a repeat. Cyclotrophs or cyclotrophic microorganism, though, are the one who can grow at refrigerated temperatures. Most of them can be killed by normal pasteurization. However, some species, like the stain of this one, can still survive the pasteurization and then cause issues or problem in finished products. Because after pasteurization, we normally store product in a fridge in chilling condition, in refrigerated condition. And these survive the previous pasteurization, now they can grow. And then they can limit the cell life, for example. Or some of them may cause food poisoning. Fungi actually become important in refrigerated dairy product spoilage when water activity, acidity, and processing methods become more favorable for them rather than for bacteria like in cheese, yogurt, and other fermented products. Uh, for example, actually when, up, when people make yogurt, they put yogurt in a fridge and in such condition, then the yeast and the mold still can grow. Especially when you open the cup of yogurt, when there is a lot of oxygen that can enter, you put in a fridge, then after several days, you see that the mold will grow on the surface because, because mold needs oxygen to grow. But without opening the cup, after um, storage life, actually the yeast can also grow. Remember, yeast can grow at low pH conditions uh, where bacteria most of them are inhibited 